What's up everybody, Alex here and welcome to this match of Dota Underlord Standard live in Season 1. Here we go. What are we going to do today? You know what, I really want to do a either a Druid game, Druid Brutes, or I want to do some Assassins. Really, really want to do some Assassins. We were just lamenting in chat over the fact that Season 2 has still not been announced. It's actually really sad. We're approaching three months overdue. A game that we're like literally a genre that desperately requires constant kind of like meta shifts and meta updates. Oh man. Force a build. Can you try to do war so void spirit forcing a build? Can you try and force warlocks and brutes? Yes, I can do that. Uh, warlock brutes. That sounds like a really interesting combination. Uh, if I'm doing warlock brute, we don't need chain mail because the brute bonus. I'll take the Kea for the shadow fiend. Yeah. Sounds good. Force of build. Here we go. That's actually, that's what I'm interested in. Can you do Warlock Brute? There's a force of build I can get behind. Something actually kind of interesting. So now though, what do I do in the interim? Take the next. I did. Warlock Brutes. Sorry, someone someone just said, I just saw Hugo. Good idea, Drew, but I didn't actually... I didn't catch Drew's message. Damn. <laughs> Hold on, I, can, I think I can scroll here. What did Drew say? Drew. Oh, interesting idea. So use the force builds from the builds of the week. No, that's, that's cool. But no, I like... But at the same time, I like the idea of doing like like what what Void Spirit just did is pretty neat. But I everyone always is like, yo, how can I make him force the worst build possible? But at the same time, though, with the force build, if you guys want to see the worst possible build of all time, then like maybe like maybe you should allow force me to do the worst possible build of all time. Maybe there's some merit to that. Maybe like you know, because then then this is just every other Dota Underlord stream. You know what I mean? So maybe there is legitimate merit in uh, doing it that way. So I laugh about being forced to do six ma six humans all the time, but at the same time, this is the only place you're gonna be forced. You're gonna see someone being forced to run six six humans in uh, in high big boss in lord in lord lobbies. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Josh. Six humans forced to build and four insects forced to build is like those are the money ones. Those are the money ones. All right, Devil, and see you, bro, as well. Devil, see you later. Bye, bye, Danielle. Have a good day as well. Thank you so much. Really appreciate that you're able to join. All right, so we are doing brutes and warlocks. I gotta think that through. It's a good. It's an interesting combination. Um, with brutes, warlocks, we gotta be so brutes. We have to level to at least seven. Warlocks gonna stay at two. Magi will probably get to two. Transition mid game with, with the druids. Yeah, we can do this. I think we can do this. Hundred void sounds cool. There's a lot of combinations that sound cool, but the problem is, is that like, they can be really difficult to pull off because you need like, you need like, there's certain bridge units right that help bridge, just like trolls and knights works because of bad rider. Right? Um, you know, uh, Hunter's Heartless works because of Drow Ranger. Um, there's, there's several units that really help to kind of build these compositions. And you're right, Big Matzo Balls, you're right. It's a hundred, it is a way more enjoyable game when you don't care about rank. And uh, I don't care so much about the rank either. The, the only thing with the force builds that can be a little funny is when people are like joining the game and they're like, what is this guy doing? Like, it's like really confusing for them. That's why I've actually said that maybe I need to set it up so like there's like a force to build icon on the screen so people know like, oh, he's being forced to do this absolute garbage. I get it. <laughs> All right. Dr. Heckle, what's up? Um, not going to, I love this, by the way, one thing I will say, I love the new art they've done. This is really nice art. Uh, this is one of the nicest I've seen in a while. So I usually do that sad, frowning, leaf facey guy. Medusa Void, maybe Brute, but Fedora is great as well. Yeah. 
That's right, we can actually do fedoras here. That might be interesting. Throw a fedora on a ranged unit. Because there's no... The fedora allows you to give a ranged unit the brute bonus. Because there's no... Uh, there's no ranged brutes, right? So that's interesting. I, I, you know what? Hugo, I think you're right. I might have to keep an eye on a fedora. Really interesting idea. We're still winning, by the way. We're on fire. He's on fire! Doing pretty good. Three and two. Here we go. There is a... Should have bought her after. Damn it. Cost myself some interest there. Cost myself a little bit of interest. That's okay. I might do this. No, don't do that. Do this. No, I won't do that. This is better. Push him back? No. I could even sit him up like that. No, it's okay. He's in. He's within one cell. It's fine. So we want to have the uh, the tree at two stars. Leech Seed does a tremendous amount of damage, actually. Here we go. Look at these Arc Warden slowing the fight down. Arc Warden Morbid Mask, not the best pickup. Morbid Mask though is like anything that's percentage based is usually pretty interesting. Like I really like I really like Talisman of Evasion. Chainmail honestly is fantastic tier one, but uh, Morbid Mask doesn't get picked up very often. But I think there's potential there, a lot of potential. So we take this. I think I take the level. Who cares? I'm not after anybody else. Activate him. I might even put two ogres in. No. Sack him. Put him here. The time. See, perfect. Oh, an anti targeting but I've not seen one of those in a while. Hey, I'll, I'll do Shadow Fiend Brute. That sounds like a great idea. Shadow Fiend attacks very quickly. Uh, Shadow Fiend's attack rate's very fast, so Nevermore is actually a great, great option for the Fedora. He would spread it across really rapidly. Yes, look at that. Was he? What's what's Treant doing? Was Treant sleeping? Did you see that? What happened there? I'm actually not sure what was going on there. We're still on fire. He's on fire. Treant doing work. Look at that leech seed doing work. I love it. Um, oh, there's Shadow Fiend. Take the level. Take the fiend. Gonna boots him here. He has to be here. Treen's gotta run this way. Shadow Fiend with the cast. Yeah, that's a good position. You know what? I'm actually kind of excited here. Brutes Warlocks. I hadn't really thought of that. Let's see what we can do. A little awkward for the Fiend. Is he gonna hit it? Oh, I think Fiend missed. Oh, no. Fiend love tapped him. I think we're going to lose this, though. This guy has too much value with these two two-stars. We can't compete with that. That was 675 health on the Fiend. There's our first loss in a while, but it's okay. If you think about it, we've actually had some pretty rough RNG. We have one-star units all across. Guys have multiple two-stars. Taking Orb. Orb. Alex, Orb. Why? Why Orb? Orb because um, the Brute Bonus can uh, is applied to different units. Brutes will attack many different units, and the Orb of Venom will allow them to spread the the wealth there. It's an it, a little unique idea. Let's try. Listen, we're not we're trying some unique stuff here, so let's let's go all the way in. Ooh, I'll take that. Now. You are stronger now. How may I, be of I think I do this. this time we I actually think I should I should get rid of the tree. Ah, oh, Treant's a brute, so no, I'm not gonna get rid of Treant. Stack that poison. Come on, Ogre. Stack the poison. Easy win. Still a request. Void Spirit, are you kidding me? This is a great request. I'm actually super excited. It's actually a really neat composition idea that I hadn't thought of myself. I think it's neat. You know, if we're going full crazy here, I might go heal and steal. 
We got Orb of Venom. Let's stack some poison too. Let's do, let's go all, all in on the silliness here. I'm gonna take Io over Magnus. I'm gonna level and put Io in. I'm gonna put the Io on the ogre on the edge here. Yeah, I think this is neat. We don't really need this. Oh well, no, we we bloodbound the ogre. We'll show them what. <clears throat> I decided to go with Anno because if we're going on the uh, if we're going with the orb of venom and we're stacking some poison, I want to see what poison can do for us. Uh oh. Oh, stay alive, ogre! Don't die on me, ogre! You're dead. Oh, Io died before you can do the thing. No! One more cask. No, they healed up. Come on, Eno. Take these guys down, Eno. Poison. Poison! Yes. Alright. We're stacking some poison here. Do we add Viper just for funsies? No, we can't. We could add Viper. No, we don't add Viper. Maybe later I add Viper in Dragon Knight and we do some Dragon Dragon Brutes. Warlock Dragon Brutes. Take a Fedora. It's been a while since I've run uh, Yoink Eno here. It's actually kind of exciting. Dr. Eno's Soothing Bomb. Okay. How many Dazzles have I passed on, by the way? I've passed on Dazzle. I can have a three-star Dazzle Boy now. Everyone I'm running is pretty much being contested. It's Choyo. Thank you so much for the follow. I do appreciate it. Welcome. Welcome to the stream. I'm also kind of stressed out that I've not activated four Warlocks yet. I gotta level and do that. I gotta activate four Warlocks. It makes no sense. It's Choyo, thank you so much. I really do appreciate that. Glad, ha so happy to hear that you enjoy the YouTube stuff. I really, I really love doing YouTube content. Really love it. Just take him and get rid of Io, eh? Get rid of Io, do this, eh? But this gives us, this gives us the treant. I don't know, man. I don't know. I might just take the level here. Well, thank you. I'm glad you're here. I might actually take this. Um... Okay, you know what? We'll take IOL. We'll activate the four warlocks for a second here. Have him come in late. We'll do this. He'll be they safe in the edge. They can win with that. Here we go, let's see. We're doing some Brutes, Warlocks, this game. And you know what, it's actually been working pretty well. I mean, so did the six humans we tried yesterday, uh, last game. Until, of course, until we got absolutely thumped. It was good until it wasn't. Come on, come on. I don't think Eno's gonna be able to take many guys down there. Oh, Eno's dead. Eno is dead, rip Eno. Let's take that level 7 there. We put Eno back in. So I'm going to do this. Eno's positioning can be awkward. You are right. Level 3 Nyx and uh, Io combo. You are right. If I can pull a Life Stealer, I will. Oh, there's a Fedora. I think we take. I think we take the Fedora. Make things interesting here. Shadow Fiend Fedora. Here we go. Shadow Fiend Fedora, here it is. Quad Brutes. We're going there. We're getting there. We will get there. Um, oh, look at these Dazzles, damn it. Yeah, Josh, you're right. That's why I did a roll there. We need to start two-starring. Got one stars everywhere. What am I doing? We're the only one at level seven, by the way. We're at 74 health. We're not doing bad. We need to two-star some guys. Good hit. We don't have enough damage here, I don't think. Let's see what we can do. Good sustained healing, though. And once we get Doom, that'll be legit. If we can pull a Doom, everything changes. Doom would be just wonderful in this build. 
We've got the win. We got the win. Level and keep those dazzles coming. Hugo, you absolute troll. <laughs> We're still doing well. We're still doing well. You won't Easy. Okay. Three-star Legion. Okay. What's what's his Legion build, though? I have not been checking. Oh, Brute Legion. Garbage. Legion and Brutes never plays nearly as well as you think it's going to. I'm telling you that right now. Oh, there's, there's Life Stealer. Not yet. We must prepare. Lock in the interest. I'll activate four brutes next. I'll activate four brutes next. Another dazzle in the shop as well. Watch this Legion Commander punish me now because I made fun of it. I'm getting punished by this Legion. Yes, Brood Mother's back. Here we go. Get out the spider, you need Necro. I know. Now, uh, Void Spirit, you're the one that called for the the the, um, the Warlocks. Do you want me to go all the way to six? Or can I stay at the four? I could try and go six. There's Shadow Fiend. Now I actually think I put Kea on him. Brute him. Let's do it. We're crazy, guys. We're out of control. No one can stop us. We're absolutely out of control at this point. We got we got four brutes. We got four warlocks. Hey, Trinity Dodo, good to see you. Replace brute with necro. We can do that. If we don't get to, if we don't want to get to six warlock. Now here's the thing, Necro and Disruptor are both excellent warlocks, but we will have to be at level 10 to get them in and we won't be able to do much else. And what build is LC actually good? Four trolls. Once you have four trolls, LC uh, becomes an absolute, like she's able to finish kills much better. Four trolls, splash her with other other alliances. Four trolls and then splash with other alliances. Minimum two trolls, but trolls and LC is the is what you do, hundred percent, no question. This uh this damn, I might have to switch this. This, this is warlock is totally useless. Made lieutenant. Wow, Astropolis, good to hear that you made lieutenant. Congratulations, great work. And I'm so happy to hear that I was able to help you do that. Fantastic. Lieutenant, Lieutenant's still an accomplishment. Keep it going. Next thing you know, it'd be boss. And before you know it, you're big boss. And before you know it, you're stream sniping me. <laughs> Else, well, yes, yeah, that assumes demons. So what you would do is you would have four trolls, and then you'd have two knights, and one of the knights has to be Chaos Knight, and that's how you activate the demon bonus for the, uh, the LC. Okay, we take this double necro necro has to go in there necro has to go in raider dog 420 thank you so much for the follow i appreciate it welcome to the community it's fantastic oh my what mantle of the twin no no way okay we're gonna watch his fight for a sec Watch what Elsie's gonna do. She's just gonna run around. She's just gonna run around. She's not even gonna attack anything. But now she's attacking. Look. Look, she's just running. Buddy, what are you doing? Why would you do that? Look at this. She's just jogging around casually. Why would you put Mantle on an LC and you're winning? No. That is a horrible play. We just won, but I couldn't believe that. He's winning. That is, oh man, that is awful. I will leave a trail of the sick and 
Die. You never play Legion Commander with Deadeye. You never play Legion Commander with Deadeye. It is a horrible play. Thank you so much for the follow, Hood Fresh. Hood Fresh with the follow. I think I might just go six Warlock, four Brutes, two Druid, and leave it. He's taunting the opponent. I'm not convinced he's taunting the opponent. I might... Uh, so I gotta fix this positioning here. Because we're not getting the boot. Boots are being activated too early. Oh, Necro got those boots. That was kind of lucky. We got, we got, so the healing bonus, by the way, is key here. So now we've activated healers, so we're gonna get a little, that extra 25%. We just completely destroyed this guy. He's lucky he was a ghost. Isn't the point of it to be easy dual damage, but you're just running around, Pan. You're running around, you're not doing anything. Deadeye is like the worst. Yo, dude, Jerovich, good to see you. Welcome to the stream. I might even do this. Is LC worth it? Not LC, Lifestealer. I think I'd take Lifestealer out for Doom. Who's stupid Warlock? What's this Warlock even they doing at this point? One star Warlock, round 19. That being said, I've been hyper, I've been leveling super aggressively, so it's not really, it's not, it's not, uh, Warlock's fault. In fact, Warlock is still alive right now because he's activating his heal so frequently. If anything, it's been working well, because he activates his heal, he activates the heal on the other side. So, he's out in 7th, Dr. Heckle's gone, and we're still beating guys up. He's feeding Ogre, you are right. Ogre's hitting pretty hard. We're on fire. It's going really well. Keep Nyx, once you have Necro, you get the Heartless. I do have Necro. We do have Heartless. My lineup is so weak compared to everyone else's. Look at this. I'm first place. These guys have two multiple three stars, three star Podge, three star Wind. Look at this. My lineup is awful, but we're winning because we're sustaining very well. There's Doom. Oh, there's Doom. Soon, they will know. Does Ogre come out? For the Doom, does o do we just take out Ogre? Ogre's doing well though, but... So you're saying life stealer? Keep life stealer over ogre. Let's check contention. So there is contention on the ogre, contention on life stealer as well. Tons of contention on life stealer. I don't think we can actually bank on life stealer right now. You're right. Doom will silence the shadow fiend. I think we're off Life Stealer, guys. I don't care so much about the Heartless. I think we're done with Life Stealer. I think he's gone. We won't lose I'm not. Today. I know you want to get rid of Ogre, but we're not. We we might not even two star the Life Stealer right now. He's so contested. No, it's because of the contention. Life Stealer's in four lineups right now. I'm not- I'm still thinking about it. Ogre's being contested too. So 
So we're gonna beat this guy. But look, look at Life Stealer right now on this board. Okay, so only three now. Well, no, four because he's on my bench. Ogre's also contested as well. Your enemies are my enemies. No, Ogre L, keep Naix. Okay, okay. All right. You guys have never steered me wrong. Okay, we level next round. Disruptor's probably the next in. Come on, Fiend! There's the Fiend hit. Bristle's down. Snapfire's doomed, which is key. No more of his kisses there. Snap's down. Look at this sustained healing, guys. This is ridiculous. This lineup just will not go down. Wow. This lineup just will not go down. Instant sells Ogre and we all jaw drop. Hey, Warlock 2. There it is. Finally, round 23, Warlock 2. What's up? Going right to 10, guys. Right to 10. Let's push our advantage. Quick doom. You're up, Fiend. You're up, Fiend. Let's see it. The timing on and Doom and Fiend is actually pretty good. Look at this build! Guys! They're having a really... He has a way stronger lineup than us. His lineup is way stronger. From a from a hero perspective, his lineup is stronger. I think Void Spirit's onto something. Like, this has been really strong. It's really working. This healing is so insane because remember, with the brute bonus, they can't do enough damage to kill us. And the Fedora on the ranged unit. Witch Doctor's just saucing it around. Check healing stats. Anno leading in healing, but... Everyone's kind of healing. That's just regen stuff. So we're going to go right to 10, I think. And I'll, I can add in the... Uh, I could even do it now. Who cares? Booyah. Six Warlocks, four Brutes, two Healers, two Heartless... Two druids, here we go. Six warlocks is active. So we're two levels of, above most people, one level above others. And they just can't kill us. Like, I'm shocked that this is working as good as it is. Wow. Look at this. We're in the points, easy in the points. Like. We're, this guy's got one health. Like, literally, no one's dying. Oh, it's Radiance! You can't kill it! Radiance on who? Who's been surviving late? Doom? Radiance Doom? This is nuts! No, it has. this has to be on a Brute. I guess I just roll this. Oh, Doom, I lock it. Oh, I guess sell the Nevermore. Take the Doom. Um. We'll do this. So, I don't want to announce that, like, we got them early, but this is insane. Okay, Doom is in trouble, but he's, he's getting healed. He's getting healed. Radiance is still in effect. And if we can two-star him, Vlad on Necro, yeah, that's a good call. 
I, I have to fix the items. I was busy rearranging some stuff. Doom is still alive! Did you guys just see that? If you guys... Oh, Divine Rapier Steel. If you guys are watching on YouTube, go back. Like, hit, hit the... Hit, like, go back 25 seconds or whatever and take a look. Take a look at how close Doom went to dying. Um, so Vlad's, let's reposition here. So I'm just gonna keep rolling. We gotta hope for some of these two stars. Gotta be careful. Axe my culling blade. Gotta keep axe off him. There it is. Fiend's not silenced. Fiend's been casting. He's been casting the whole time. This is ridiculous. This is like 30 damage on this guy. And we just stole the Divine Rapier! Oh, last match he was doomed. Rapier on the Fiend. Rapier on the Fiend. Who cares? Why not? Let's roll. Give me something, game. Yeah. Oh! No Doom. Watch out for Axe. Let's see what he's positioning like. A-Sean, <laughs> hi YouTube. <laughs> this is going really well for us. Let's see what we can do here. Doom's got to stay up. Doom is down. Early. Oh, Doom with the heal! Doom's up! Did you guys just see it again? Did you guys just see how close Doom came to dying? The clutch heal is insane! He's at two health! He's at two health! This is insane! How much healing is being done? Four kills on Doom. Come on, sauce me a Doom. Oh, Disruptor. Oh, this hurts. It hurts. But we gotta take it. We gotta take it. He's not... I don't think we gotta move. This build is nuts. Bad static, okay, bad static field there. So, Fiend got the cast off before Doom. We're destroying him. We're destroying him. That was too easy. I am in shock with how good that build was. And that was a force of build. And the game's crashing. Guys, that was a ridiculous build! Unbelievable! Thank you guys so much for watching, and a very special thank you to Void Spirit for the build, and for all my wonderful subscribers. Take care, everyone, and have yourselves a wonderful day.